Alright, what's up guys? Hey, I just want to make a video showing how to make your computer look like a little more like Vista without um, screwing your computer up by installing Vista. Um, so if you still want to stick around with XP and keep the same speed as XP, but uh, make your computer look like Vista, um, there's a nice program that you can use to do that. Anyways, um, so right now I don't have it installed, and you can see it's the, in my opinion, disgusting blue look of XP. Anyways. Here's how to fix this, or how to install the program. Basically, um, open up your Internet Explorer, or uh, browser of your choice. I like all three. Give it a second. It's slow with the video recorder. Holy crap, it's slow. Alright. You're going to type in crystalxp.net. C-R-Y-S-T-A-L-X-P. XP.net. Okay. Go there. What the hell? Go away. Oh, you gay thing. Alright. Anyways, there's a little button here called Brico Packs. You want to click on that. And as soon as that comes up, scroll down, you see this big, huge icon that says Vista Inspirat 2. You're going to open that up. And download the installer. This is about a 30 meg download, so it'll take a couple minutes on most most PCs, a little bit more, a little bit less. Anyways, I already have the installer, so we're going to go up here and install it. Let's see what I have. Where? Hold on a second. Sorry. Okay, I remember now. All right. So basically, it's a little like this. It's an inside a zip file. You don't need to extract it, you can only do it if you want to, it doesn't matter. Anyways, go ahead and do that, open that up. This is going to pop up. Alright, English, <laughs> for all our English people, that would work great. This will work on most versions of XP, um, SP1, SP2, or even without the SP, Server 2003, Media Center, or Tablet. Um, but it won't work with X64, so if you have an X X64 computer, it won't work. All right. So, agree to the license terms. Um, I would suggest um, either total, if you want to just go for it, or personalized. Uh, I'm going to do personalized here. Keep all these checked, definitely. Um, oh, wait, Internet Explorer. I already have IE7. Yeah, I already have IE7. Um, so, I would uncheck apply wallpaper. I already like my wallpaper, so I'm going to keep that. Um, so I'm going to uncheck that. Definitely keep apply visual styles. Cursors. Um, it has a nice little cursor. Sounds. I would check that. Rocket dock. Um, you can see up here. This comes with it. It's not. They didn't make it. But um, it's a nice program that's included. It's basically like a Mac. And you can put it anywhere in your screen. It's very highly customizable. I'm actually going to make another video on that shortly about it. It looks really jumpy. It's just my video card can plugged in the video recorder. So anyway, it's a very cool program. Um, so we're going to enable Rocket Dock Transbar. Um, nice program. Um, makes your uh, bar down here very transparent and it's nice. Looks like Vista Uber icon. Makes a little special effects on the um, icons and YZ shadow. Makes a little drop shadow around the uh, window. Alright, so we're going to click next and go for it. <coughs> Alright, and this will take about two minutes to install, about. I'd say, you know, le less or more, depending on your hard drive instance. Um, running a very slow uh, video recorder here. It's slowing the crap out of my computer. But it's a nice video recorder. 